Hi friends, we are going to see how to solve alignment issue in TVS LP46 light R plus. It is uh, basically this alignment issue will be like up and down issues like that. That kind of issue you can resolve by doing these settings. So before going to do the settings, please download the tool from TVS website. So I'm just I have just opened Chrome, Google Chrome. TVS LP46 light driver download so I'm just going to click first link TV website link so it is loading now we got the site now just click on download now just download this utilities so downloader is completed now just go to show folder so i'm going to extract this file extracted open now utilities direct tool so this is the tool which we we are going to use to solve the element issue so after opening the, this tool i'm going to click get status the printer status is ready now if you click get here automatically the inbuilt settings will be appearing on the printer so here you can able to see paper width paper height and then media sensor is in continuous so if you're using gap sticker you need to use gap so what i'm going to do initially i'm going to do the factory default so just click this factory default the printer will go to factory default settings so just wait for three to four seconds the factory default will happen um, just wait it is done now it is in factory default settings now I am going to do the calibration and printer so this settings will make the printer to the proper alignment like uh, whatever the sticker size you use in the printer if you click on this calibrate sensor automatically the sensing will happen and it will be in a proper tearing position just click calibrate so now we can able to see change to media sensor gap settings is fine just going to to save these settings just click set now try to give print test page you will be getting only one page out again click one time you will be getting one page out so that's all the one page will be coming as print test page test like that the print out print output will be there that's all now the settings is done now we can use now we can able to see the element issue is resolved thank you